In this video, we're going to show you the recent changes around offers and commissions. It used to be two separate products. Everything else works the same, but now they've combined them together. So I'm in an opportunity here, and under the offers and commissions tab, it's now combined. It even says commissions update. Once you accept and manage commission, you can now view, edit, and submit your commission. So it's about still using the offer to unlock the commissions, but now they've combined those together. So I'm going to add a quick offer on this. I'm going to leave the name initial offer one. When I say create offer, I can leave that there. What is the original close date we're shooting for? Let's say it is for March 5th. Who are the parties? I just need a name. So I will say Mickey Mouse as an example. I can put the agent's name. So Donald Duck. Click on terms. And what are we offering? So I can select from the listing for this. So if it's not in the system, we want to get it in the system. I'm actually going to type in here, let's just pretend for this example, just to move this along, I'm going to select whatever the first listing shows up. If this is the listing, now I can put in the terms and the cash. So the cash on this is going to be, let's say they're offering 300000 and that's going to be the actual cost. From here, I'm able to put in information if I need, but for simplicity and just moving this along, agent analysis is not required. Click save, and guess what? I now have an offer. Now, this offer needs to be accepted to get to the commissions. Notice there's no commission yet. So I'm accepting this offer, and now I have the option to manage the commission. This is how we're going to manage the commission and do the commission submission. So I'm going to click Manage Commission, and this now looks just like we had before with the commission in place. So I'm going to come to Edit Information, because it didn't have the contract date. Now, if I go to details and add the original contract date, this would have been filled in. But since I didn't, I can come here and say, you know what, we're under contract as of today, which is the fourth. I click Save Changes. We're at a 3% commission on a $300,000 sale, which is $9,000 commission total. I click Save Changes. And now that has been managed and is ready here. Right now, I have it as me getting paid the one unit down below, so the royalty for the association uh, for KWRI is 6%. My market center commission is 3%. Now this cap tool is in the past. So this is gonna show you what previously is done. It's not in real time yet. So a lot of people have been asking about that. From here, I have the ability to edit the agent payment and that's where you're gonna do things like deductions or give this to KDB Cares. So maybe I wanna donate $15 to KDB Cares. I could put that in. Extra payment options like referrals or bonuses, that's where you can put those in. So maybe I'm actually putting in an outside referral, inside referral. Maybe there's a deduction, concession, or a bonus like uh, maybe I'm getting an administrative fee of $350. And I don't split it at the market center. I can add that here. Click Save Changes. And all my changes are here on the right. So I can now see out of my $9,000, I have a $350 bonus. The office, I have 561 going to KDBRI. I have 2,700 going to the company. I am deducting $15, so I should be getting $6,074 on this sale. You can add a note if you need to. This is a test. Please delete. Save changes. And once you're ready with all the information, you hit submit. By the way, if you need to add another agent or you're splitting this with another person, you can add that here and just make sure this one is less than one. So if I'm doing a 50-50 split, mine would be 0.5 of the 9,000 and I would add another agent and then they would be the other 0 0.5, 0 0.5 like that. And then it would calculate the commission. That's how you're gonna do this. You hit submit and now we've done an offer. We've submitted it here. This is now giving you some information. You can terminate that. You can come back to offers. You can modify this offer if you need to. Add analysis, send offer, remove offer. So that's how we're going to take advantage of offers and commissions in this new format. Thanks so much for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out. If you like this video, give it a like. Leave a comment below. I'd love to hear from you. And as always, follow me on KB Connect and YouTube today.